Good morning, guys, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Mary Beth. I am on a weight loss journey. I am down 40 pounds on the Weight Watchers plan. I was on blue. I've recently switched to green. I would still love to lose another 30 pounds, 20, 30 pounds, somewhere in there. So currently I'm on the Weight Watchers green plan, and today I'm gonna take you through a full day of what I'm eating on a Friday on the Weight Watchers green plan, getting back on track. I am just coming off my cycle and your girl has eaten any and everything in sight and the scale is showing that and I'm so excited to eat things that are good for me. So I'm gonna start out with my toddlers here. He is yelling at me. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna start off with a hot cup of coffee. I just brewed some coffee. I like to use this coffee. I get it at Walmart. I think it's fantastic. Um, I've got my cup. On my scale, I have a fourth cup of Splenda in there, and I'm gonna go in with three tablespoons or 45 milliliters of this Aldi sugar-free creamer. It is 1.43 tablespoons, which is fantastic. So I'm going to enjoy this cup of coffee. I'm going to plan my meals for this next week and my grocery pickup order, and I will have breakfast or another cup of coffee in a little bit. Today's goals are get the house picked up and ready for the weekend, stay completely on track, and do a workout. That's it. Those are the only goals today and I'm gonna take you guys along with me. So I hope you're excited. If you're excited to see this and you enjoy what I eat in the days, give this video a like. And if this is the first time you have ever seen my face before, hello, welcome. You should subscribe, it's a fun place here. Um, and my Instagram is also a good place to be. It's MB does WW. I would love to have you guys over there, but I will see you guys back in a little bit. I'm going to go enjoy my hot cup of coffee. Hey guys. So we're back. As you can see, we're in the same spot, which means we're making more coffee. So I have right here. This is the Trader Joe's like instant coffee packets. I thought this would be good to make like a cold brew situation. So I have just a skosh of coffee left from my hot coffee this morning. I am pouring that in. Okay. It looks crazy. And then I'm going to have my machine. I have um, the Ninja coffee bar and I'm going to just have it brew like the specialty brew of some hot water in there. Oh, that looks so crazy. Yeah, have it brew that into there and I'm going to get a cup. Let me show you guys. I'm going to grab my cup. Is my cup dirty? Okay, I'm gonna wash up my cup and I'm gonna show you guys how I make an iced coffee. I don't even know what's happening in my life. Um, I'm gonna show you guys how I make my iced coffee and um, if I don't like it, I will make something different. Okay. So the coffee's brewing. I'm going to make some sweet cream cold foam. So this is just a tiny cup. I am, let me move you guys down here. This is our outfit of the day. We have an Under Armour bra, and these little shorts are from Old Navy. They're cheetah print. They're like a cotton material. I like them. All right, sweet cream cold foam. So we're gonna go in with our sugar-free French vanilla creamer. Again, three tablespoons. Okay, then we're gonna go in with one packet of Stevia. I just get the little packets from Walmart. Put that right in on top. Then we're gonna take our frother. You're gonna see the consistency like totally change in um, the cream, like it'll get foamy, obviously. I like to blend it for a really long time. Okay, set this to the side. So now our coffee is done. Take this, open it up. I just wanna be sure that it's all like blended and stuff really well. Again, I've not done this before. This could end terribly. Cup of ice. It's pretty hot. Oh well. It'll be fine. It made way more than I expected it to. 
that's where we're at with that. And then we're going to do two pumps of the um, skinny syrup. This is the caramel vanilla flavor. So good. Just two pumps, so that's all that I personally need. Okay, and then you all know I like a really sweet cream of coffee. We're going to grab our scale one more time. Zero it out. And again, three tablespoons. This is a two-point coffee. Or, yes, it's a two-point coffee. Okay. I'm going to take our straw. Give it a little mix. Wow, I like that better than I thought I would. It doesn't even really need the sweet cream. I mean, I'm gonna put it on there anyway, but. Oh my goodness, that's so good. Okay, 10 out of 10 recommend these Trader Joe's instant coffees. Okay, I'm drinking them. A little more. I have stopped going to Starbucks because they got rid of the, um, the cinnamon dolce sugar free ugh, creamer and that is, or the syrup. That's what I put in my, um, coffees. They got rid of that. So I have not been going to Starbucks nearly as often. And honestly, I'm to the point where I prefer this and I got it all over the lid. So I'm gonna have to clean that up. I'm preferring this and it's way cheaper, way, way cheaper. These syrups, I find, I found this one at TJ Maxx. It's like four bucks. It's gonna last me forever. Stevia's inexpensive, coffee's inexpensive. I mean, I don't know. I'm really liking making my coffee at home and I can have it whenever I want. I live in the middle of nowhere. So the closest Starbucks is literally 30 minutes from me. Mm. I'm going to sip on this, keep playing house, and I will see you guys. I don't know if I'm going to eat breakfast today. I have eaten so much over the last few days, and I'm not, like, restricting or punishing myself. I just, I'm not hungry. So, I may wait for lunch, and I think for lunch, we're going to either have fajitas or quesadilla. So, hey, guys. So, it is 1040, and I am hungry, and I want lunch. So, we are going to have an early lunch today. I'm going to be cooking up some of this beef fajita mix. It is the John Souls Foods brand. I love this steak. It is so good. Um, you can have <clears throat> three ounces for 120 calories, and I think that's three points. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to weigh it out, zero out my scale with it on there, and we're gonna go for three, ounces and see how that looks. Okay. That is three ounces. Let me see. Trying to decide if I want to do more meat or not. I think so. Let's go for six ounces. Break it up a little. That's plenty. That's five ounces. Okay. This is what we've got. We've got five ounces. Takes two seconds to cook up. Okay. So I also have leftover cheesy rice that I made the other day. It's the old El Paso cheesy rice. And I have some leftover fat free refried beans. You guys have seen me make these before, but I'm making them again, and I had all of this stuff left over in the fridge. So, I'm going to take two of these wraps, and I'm going to take a spoon. cold. I know some people do. Doesn't bother me. I do not have light sour cream. I really wish I had light sour cream. So one 
tablespoon. Two tablespoons is 60 calories, which isn't terrible. I know, I just should have gotten the light sour cream. So, two tablespoons is... 30 grams. Okay, so we're going to set it to grams. Zeroed it out. 30 grams. I'd really like to use like 7 grams on each, okay? 6, 5, 7. Okay, so that's a half a tablespoon. It is not a lot of sour cream but I don't want to spend all my points today on lunch. And look how much it spreads out, okay? That's plenty for me. If you got the light sour cream, you could use more. Okay, spread this one out. Delicious, okay. Then, why are my beans coming along? Take our spoon, mix up our beans. Not warm enough. Stick that back in there. I'm gonna add just a little bit of water to this rice. Just a little. Keep it fluffy. Feel like microwaved. Another 30 seconds. I am going to put uh, a little bit of, I'll use one serving, which is a fourth of a cup, so I'll do an eighth of a cup on each one. Um, it's 90 calories. I think it's two or three points. I can't remember. I'll put all the points um, down below. But I'm gonna do a little bit of the reduced fat cheese. And I'm gonna put some lettuce on it. I like to put the lettuce on it. I think my toddler just ran through here and he's naked, so that's exciting. <laughs> uh, and I'm gonna put the lettuce on it. The lettuce really bulks it up. It really does. Okay, so our beans should be good and hot. Yeah. These are fat free. If you're on the blue plan, these are free. These are zero points, okay? So I'm gonna take one tablespoon and pop it on. Each one. I just think this really adds a little thump, thump. You know? One tablespoon. On each one. We look. Then I'm going to put on the cheese, the lettuce, the steak, and I'll plate it up and I'll show you guys what it looks like in just a second. Okay, so I just plated up my food. <clears throat> All together, it is 13 points. Um, I've got four points worth of the meat, two points worth of wraps, one point worth of sour cream, one point worth of refried beans, one point worth of cheese, and ooh, a piece of steak fell out. Four points worth of rice. This is our 13 point lunch breakfast thing. Okay, I'm feeling a little snacky. I want a little sweet treat after my lunch. So I have the cookie butter. You can have 18 grams of it for four points. So let's see what 18 grams looks like. Oh no. My thing shut off. Okay, so we're gonna measure out. Going for 18 grams. Actually, this is nine grams. That's a lot. So we're gonna go with nine grams for hopefully two points, a banana, and a whole bunch of water. Hey guys, so my kid is playing in the background, so I'm sure you will hear his remote control car. I am making a salad. I am suddenly, this lettuce is not in the best shape, starving. So I'm taking a little iceberg lettuce nothing crazy i am so snacky today i think it's a combination of like cutting off my cycle and um just have eaten so much the last several days so i will most likely dip into my weeklies tonight but that's what they're there for i don't plan to go crazy but 
If I go into my weeklies because I ate a salad, <laughs> then it is what it is, you know? So I am going to top this with a little of this reduced fat cheese. Scale, people. Scale, scale, scale. We are measuring everything. 28 grams is a fourth of a cup. grams just like earlier that's one point then I'm gonna do some of these real bacon pieces um, one tablespoon which is seven seven grams is 30 calories I don't know how many points that is but 30 calories it can't be that much you know zero it out I'm gonna grab a spoon What is your favorite? Okay, that much is only four. Maybe just a little more to get that seven. Okay, I did five. Just a little. You don't need to touch. This is a snack after all. Then we're of course going in with some Bolt House Farms, and I do have some Dino Nugs cooking up. Sounds good. Listen, I'm just gonna cut up a couple dino nugs, stick them in. I don't know what the points are. I'm gonna have to look that up. Going for 30 grams. Okay. Did actually uh, 60 grams because I wasn't paying attention. So, salad, all the fixings. I'm gonna put a couple dino nuggets on top, and this is going to be a snack. So I never finished up my what I ate today yesterday. So I just wanted to come on this morning. Last night for dinner, we ended up going to Taco Bell. And I had the um, chicken power bowl that I always get that I've shared before. It's 14 points on green. It's very filling. I love it. It makes me feel like I'm eating something bad. But it fits perfectly into my points. Um, so that is what I ended the day with yesterday. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.